Hello, Aternum, and welcome to KOTT News, Aternum's number one source for news. And this is the War Report. Dynamic change in the history of Aternum last night as the Covenant hero worshippers of outcasts re-secure the bamboo forest preserves of Ebenscale Reach. No official word from City Hall on the matter, as outcast forces immediately began preparing for their next engagement. More on that later. A new group of marauders making their presence felt around the mosh pits last night as the qualifying races for Cutlass Keys progressed throughout the evening. Small group skirmishes broke out around the towers, but traveling in greater number, the outcome favored the marauders. More on that later. Three more submissions for simulated fantasy combat resolution tonight, brought to you by LARPCO. Remember, if it isn't LARPCO, it's cardboard. Tonight, the Marauders of Emotional Damage attack the citrus-hating zealots of Waffle House for crown and kingdom of the Western Monarch's Bluff. Emotional Damage come to the fight ready to rush the ailing zealots and push them off the bluff. But will they be able to face their enemy or become stunned by them? Nobody is quite sure how they remain standing at this stage of their condition Except, of course, that they are Waffle House Company, and they are simply made of tougher stuff. Meanwhile, the Covenant hero worshippers of Outcasts assault the Syndicate members of Fresh Bench for control of the Master Fishing Delta of Reekwater. Outcasts go on the offensive again, pressing their momentum and double-timing it through Everfall in order to set up an assault camp outside the fort with all the fences. Fresh Bench, mindful of the difference in demeanor for Outcast of late, are making greater preparations for another conflict between these two that could go either way. Also, the Marauders of Sin assail the Covenant hero worshippers of Outcast for control of the crocodile-infested marsh pits of the Southern Cutlass Keys. The Marauders of Sin were seen serving spears to zealots during the races, but they won't be able to outnumber their enemy during tonight's official matchup. In their other engagement on the hour, outcast defensive specialists will be deployed to prevent this fresh group of marauders from entering their keep. We'll have any late-breaking outcomes and reactions from the citizens tonight at 11. Until then... This has been War Correspondent John Chalant, KOTT News.